Drone sightings at correctional institutions in South Carolina have more than doubled in the past two years. And just last week, two Greenville County men were arrested for using a drone to try to drop contraband into the state prison in Ridgeland. So I took a closer look at the number of sightings and just how the Department of Corrections is cracking down on the problem. You know, it's a scary, dangerous thing. They could be five miles away. They can carry up to 20 pounds. Drones making dangerous deliveries to correctional institutions in South Carolina. Drugs, weapons, cell phones, cell phone chargers, things of that nature, which are very dangerous inside a correctional institution. The number of drone sightings around correctional institutions in the state has increased drastically in the past five years. In 2023, there was nearly a sighting a day. <coughs> Brian Sterling, director of the South Carolina Department of Corrections, says one item is driving the problem. These folks were not able to coordinate the drone drops and buying and selling and paying for the drugs because the drugs cost money and they've got to pay for it with electronic currency. They don't use cash without the cell phones. So if we can eliminate the cell phones, we will severely eliminate the, the drone attacks. A problem that can even be deadly. We do see drug overdose de deaths because of um, um, drugs being flown in that you know, people take and they don't know what's in them. Sterling says the work of law enforcement and a technology called D-Drone are helping combat the issue. They track the drone, they triangulate it. So not only do we know that it's flying over the institution, which we had that technology in our institutions for a while, and we would take uh, countermeasures, now we can trace back to where they're actually flying from. The SCDC says right now the technology is online in four prisons, and it plans to expand to eight more, including Perry and Tiger River in the upstate, next quarter. Let's take a closer look now at the most common characteristics of the drones the SCDC says it sees. Sterling says in 2023, 18 people were arrested on charges involving drones.